God bless you. Beautiful, beautiful. I love that. Mercy me. Even if, even if. I'll turn it around in a minute. Um, you bet I don't know if you've seen that cross or not. The cross that's on the back of, of the chair. On the back of the chair. Oops. There's, all right, that cross right there, you bet. That was my daddy's cross that we that he had he had on the pulpit stand. The one that my daddy made. And we found it. We've lost a lot of things through the years. But that was found. That was found. Alright, I'm gonna turn the camera around now. Hang on to say I'll turn the camera around. <clears throat> okay. Okay, I'm here. I'm here. Hello everybody. 
I forgot to put my lipstick on. Oops. I forgot to put my lipstick on, but I guess that's all right. I've done that before, too. Try to get everything prepared and stuff, and then I, I always forget something, but that's all right. That's all right. I love you guys. I'm glad that you joined. Glad that you joined. I hope that you have that you had a blessed day today. Praise God! It was found. Precious memories. Yes, Teresa. Precious memories. How pretty you look in blue. Oh, thank you, Yvette. And you know something else? I just found out a couple days ago that I missed your birthday. I missed your birthday. So happy belated birthday to you, sweetheart. I'm so very, very sorry. I hadn't been on Facebook for a while, hadn't been on there, and binary, binary agent go, joined, well, hello, and I'm Pastor Gloria, welcome to my scope, God bless you, and um, love that golden crown look, oh, well, thank you, it's not gold, it's silver, it's silver, it's, I don't know what it is, this lighting in the bedroom, I don't, I don't know, that's okay, just another day for me, I know, it. another year older, I know, <laughs> Another year older. But uh, anyway, um, I wanted to get on here tonight for a little bit. Oh, But I wanted to get on here tonight just for a little bit. Just wanted to check in there with everybody and see how everybody's doing tonight. And um, I wanted to play that song. I uh, shared and I also put it on uh, my YouTube. I uploaded it to my YouTube. Um, the End Time Prophecy by um, Pastor... Um, I can't even think of his name and I, I watched it again today too uh, well my goodness it was a 1973 end times prophecy um, I can't think of his name I can't think of his name it'll come to me it'll, it'll come to me <laughs> my 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 Thank you for the beautiful hearts. I love the video of the rainbow. Awesome. Oh, that was. I had Speaking of that, I had just watched that video when um, Steve come back here and he told me, he said, you've got to come out here. He said, you've got to see this beautiful rainbow. And I grabbed, I grabbed my phone. I grabbed my phone and, and I went out there and I, he, he watched it for a few seconds first before he come and got me. One sink for sink. See fan join. Well, hello, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. David Wilkerson. Yes. How could I forget that? I just watched that again, but yes, that was something. That was something. And and I said that on, on the on the video too, you know, that, that that was a prophecy that God gave him way back in 1973. And I I got something wrong on that. I was 19, not 21. I was 19. I lost my daddy when I was 17 in 1971. And that prophecy came out in 1973, so that would have made me 19. So I, want, I wanted to kind of clear that up too. So um, anyway, I guess everybody, is everybody doing okay today? Like I said, I just wanted to get on here. I wasn't going to be on here too awful long. I want to do the Lord's Prayer. I want to do the Lord's Prayer also. Okay, I'm going to do the Lord's Prayer. Our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen and amen. And they all said amen. I hope that so I hope that song wasn't too loud because I did have the volume up kinda up loud. I hope it wasn't too loud on there. Um but um all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna read. I'm gonna get in the book. I'm gonna get in the book into the book. I'm going to read. It was good, Gloria. Thank you, Yvette. Okay. You know, a song came to me today. Um, it was a Beatles song. Hey Jude. 
And I don't know why that that song came to me. I don't know why that song came to me, but it did. And the, there must have been a reason for it. So, I feel like the Lord wanted me to read Jude. You know, um, he, 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 does, he does things. He does things. Jude's a very short chapter. It's a short chapter, but I'm going to read it, okay? I'm going to read Jude. And that's back at the back of the Bible before Revelation. Angels 1305, John. Well, hello. I, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. I'm glad, I'm glad that you joined. Um, I'm not going to make this scope very long. Um, you can also go back and watch the replay. But um, the top of the page says, Loved by the Father. And then on the other on the other page, in the book of Jude, it's it's the, the book right before Revelation, the book of Revelation. Uh, it says, keep yourselves in God's love, in God's love. But yeah, the, the Lord, that song came to me today, and I always liked the Beatles, I mean, all them years ago. But I hadn't even thought of that song in years and years. But, so he wants me to read Jude, the general epistle of Jude. So if you want to turn with me and read it, it's just a really short chapter. I'm just letting the Holy Spirit lead, letting the Holy Holy Spirit lead. And I do feel bad because I missed your birthday, you bet. I'll make it up to you. I'll make it up to you, dear. Evie Corral 7 joined. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope, and God bless you. If I can get this just a second here I had I had been reading out of first John I've been reading out of first John also and um, like I said I let I let the Holy Spirit that, that was what I the last thing I read was be sure the spirits are of God that's the last one I read uh, chapter 4 and chapter 5 okay and the last one I read. All right. So we're going to read Jude. I have seven. Thank, well, praise God. Hallelujah. I have seven on here tonight. Praise God. Hallelujah. Okay. We're going to read Jude. Jude, the servant of Jesus Christ and brother of James, to them that are sanctified by God the Father and preserved in Jesus Christ and called. It says, Mercy unto you, <clears throat> mercy unto you and peace and love be multiplied. And that's in reference to 1 Peter 1 2. Beloved, when I gave all diligence diligence to write unto you of the common salvation, it was needful for me to write unto you and exhort you that ye should earnestly contend for the faith which was once delivered unto the saints which was once delivered unto the saints. For there are certain men crept in unawares who were before of old ordained to this condemnation, ungodly men, ungodly men, turning the grace of our God into lasciviousness and denying the only Lord God and our Lord Jesus Christ. Jehakim ben Israel joined. Well, hello, God bless you. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. I'm just reading out of the book of Jude. The book of Jude. Verse 5. I will therefore put you in remembrance, though ye once knew this, how that the Lord, having saved the people out of the land of Egypt, afterward destroyed them that believed not. Destroyed them that believed not. And the angels which kept not their first estate, but left their own habitation, he hath reserved in everlasting chains, under darkness unto the judgment of the great day it goes right back it goes right back to his judgment to his wrath here we go verse 7 even as Sodom and Gomorrah and the cities about them in like manner giving themselves over to fornication hello I'm glad you joined to fornication and going after strange flesh are set forth for an example suffering the vengeance of eternal fire See, it all, it all fits together. It all fits together. Okay, verse 8 of Jude, of Jude. Likewise, also, these filthy dreamers defile the flesh, despise dominion, 
and speak evil of dignities. Big P, Big P Big Pants joined. Well, good evening. I'm Pastor Gloria. God bless you and welcome to my scope. I'm going to read uh, verse 8 again of Jude. Of Jude. First chapter. And there's only one chapter, so. It says, Likewise, all see also these filthy dreamers defile the flesh, despise dominion, and speak evil of dignities. Yet Michael, the archangel, when contending with the devil, he disputed about the body of Moses. About the body of Moses. Durst not bring against him a railing accusation, but said, The Lord rebuked thee, but these speak evil of those things which they know not, but what they know naturally as brute beasts. In those things they corrupt themselves. They corrupt themselves. Woe unto them, for they have gone in the way of Cain and ran greedily after the error of Balaam for reward and perished in the gainsaying of Korah. Korah, I hope I pronounced that right, I hope. <laughs> These are spots in your feasts of charity, meaning love. Armand's and you and join. Well, hello, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope and God bless you. Uh, verse 12 again. These are spots in your feasts of charity when they feast with you, feeding themselves without fear. Clouds they are without water, carried about of winds, trees whose fruit withereth without fruit, twice dead, plucked up by the roots. And that's in reference to Proverbs 25, 14. Raging waves of the sea foaming out their own shame, Wandering stars to whom is reserved the blackness of darkness forever. Now there's a word to this. There's a word. And Enoch, also the seventh from Adam, prophesied of these sayings. Behold, the Lord cometh with ten thousand of his saints. The Lord cometh with ten thousand of his saints. To execute judgment upon all and to convince all that are ungodly. Among them of all their ungodly deeds, which they have ungodly committed. And of all their hard speeches which ungodly sinners have spoken against him. Who are the who are the saints? Who are who are the saints? Hang on just a second. That's in, that's uh, chapter. I mean that's verse fourteen. It says and Enoch also the seventh from Adam prophesied of these sayings. Behold, the Lord cometh with ten thousands of his saints to execute judgment upon all. When the, the day of the Lord, the day of the Lord, Psalms 148, Psalms 148. Okay, I'll read that here in just a few minutes, okay? Hang on just a second, I'll read it, One four, Psalms 148. Which is, ungodly sinners have spoken against him. These are murmurers, complainers walking after their own lusts, and their mouth speaketh great swelling words, having men's Men's persons in admiration because of advantage. But, beloved, remember ye the words which were spoken before of the apostles of the Lord Jesus Christ. How that they told you there should be mockers. Here we go. Mockers in the last time who should walk after their own ungodly lusts. Amen. These be they who separate themselves, sensually having not the spirit. Most likely joined again. But ye, beloved, building up yourselves on your most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost. Praying in the Holy Ghost. Keep yourselves in the love of God, looking for the mercy of our Lord and Jesus Christ unto eternal life. What is the Spirit? Praying in the, the sea. But ye, beloved, building up yourselves on your most holy faith, praying in the Holy Ghost. Keeping, keep yourselves in the love of God, looking for the mercy of our Lord Jesus Christ into eternal, into eternal life. Okay, verse 19. These be they who separate themselves, sensual, having not the Spirit. Meaning this, the Spirit of, of, of the, the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of, of, of the Lord. Alright. Verse 22. As some have compassion making a difference John 6 63 
and others saved with fear, pulling them out of the fire, hating even the garment spotted by the flesh. 24. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding glory. To the only, to the only wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and forever. Amen. And that's in reference to Romans 16, 27. All right, I'm going to go over to Psalms. I'm going to go over to Psalms. I like getting into the book, to the word. Go over, go over to Psalms. 148.14, okay. 148.14. Lil Schubert joined. Well, good evening. I'm Pastor Gloria. Let's see, 148 or 143. I forgot what you said. One forty eight. Okay, that's what I thought. One forty eight. Hang on just a minute. Jordan Dunlap, Jordan. Well, hello, J brother Jordan. I'm glad. I'm glad. Shalom, Pastor. Well, shalom to you too. Okay, one forty eight. Okay, one forty eight. I'm gonna just read. I'm just gonna read one forty eight. I'm gonna read one forty eight because I'm sure that it's it's all good. It's all good. I'm gonna just read one forty eight of Psalms. Psalms 148. All right. Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord from the heavens. Praise him in the heights. How have you been, Gloria? I've been fine. I've been I've been great. I've been great. And how have you been, Brother Jordan? How have you been? I've been just wonderful. Just wonderful. Yes. All right. Doing good. But well, that's wonderful. All right. I'm going to start it over. One, Psalms 148. Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord from the heavens. Praise him in the heights. Praise ye him, all his angels. Praise ye him, all his hosts. Praise ye him, sun and moon. Praise him, all ye stars of light. Praise him, ye heavens of heavens, and ye waters that be above the heavens. Let them praise the name of the Lord, for he commanded, and they were created. Yes, yes, yes. Lion, no name, join. Well, well, hello, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. I'm reading Psalms 148. He hath also established them forever and ever. He hath made a decree which shall not pass. Praise the Lord from the earth, ye dragons and all deeps. Fire and hail, snow and vapors, stormy wind fulfilling his word. Demer 0861 join. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. Mountains and all hills, fruitful trees and all cedars. I'm reading Psalms 148. Beasts and all cattle, creeping things and flying fowl, kings of the earth and all people, princes and all judges of the earth, both young men and maidens, old men and children. Let them praise the name of the Lord, for his name alone is excellent. His glory is above the earth and heaven. He also exalted the horn of his people, the praise of all his saints, even of the children of Israel, a people near unto him. Praise ye the Lord. Yes. Yes. I love it. I love it. Yvette, how are you doing tonight, sweetie? Okay. Are you sure? Israel are the saints. Do you... Uh, Israel, yes, Israel is, they are God's people. They are, they are God's people. They are God's people. Yes, Israel, Jerusalem, they're God, they're, they are, they are God's people. I mean, we are too, but yeah, and Jesus is coming soon. He is coming soon. Make no mistake about it. He's coming soon. All right. Is the Lord telling, is the Lord telling you something? Um, I can sense something isn't quite right. I can sense something. Can you read Acts 5.31? I sure can. Acts 5.31. Acts 
Everything everything happens for a reason. Mark Luke John. Acts five. Acts five. Acts five through the one. Kayla Talent Journal. Well, good evening. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. Going to read Acts chapter 5, verse 31. Verse 31. Okay, verse 31. Hangman Jerome, well, hello. And God bless you, everybody that's joining. God bless you all. And thank you for the beautiful hearts. Hearts for Jesus. Always hearts for Jesus. Earn non earn three join. Well, hello. I'm I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. Okay, Acts chapter 5, verse, verse 31. Him hath God exalted with his right hand to be a prince and a savior for it, for to give repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins. And forgiveness of sins. I always like to read, I like to read up, I like to read a few, a few verses ahead when, when, I'm, when I'm reading. I've, I've always done that. I've always done that. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. I have ten. Okay. Just a minute. Can only Israel can only Israel be saved? No, no, no. Is a Hebrew princess joined? Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope, and God bless you. We're re we're in we're in uh, the book of Acts. We're in the book of Acts. Okay. Hang on just a second here. I always like to read a little bit before I read. All right. I'm going to start at verse 25 of Acts chapter 5. Then came one and told them, saying, Behold, the men whom ye put in prison are standing in the temple and teaching the people. Then went the captain with the officers and brought them without violence for they feared the people lest they should have been stoned and when they had brought them they set them before the council and the high priest asked them saying did not we straightly command you that ye should not teach in in this name and behold ye have filled jerusalem with your doctrine and intend to bring this man's blood upon us then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, We ought to obey God rather than men. Yes. Erica 0270 joined. Well, hello, Erica. Uh, God bless you. Welcome to my scope. I'm Pastor Gloria. And we're reading out of Acts chapter 5. All right. Uh, verse, I'm going to read 29 again. Then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, We ought to obey God rather than men. Yes. Yes. The God of our fathers raised up Jesus, whom ye slew and hanged on a tree. Him hath God exalted with his right hand to be a prince and a savior, for to give repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins. I, lo I love getting into the word. I love getting into the word. And we are his witnesses of these things, and so is he also the Holy Ghost, whom God hath given to them that obey him. Yes, what name, what name is he talking about? Um, things and so is also the Holy Ghost which God hath given to them that obey Him. The Holy, the Holy, the Holy Ghost to to Israel. You can jump in any time you bet if you want to. I'm I'm a little little slow tonight. I'm just a little bit slow tonight, honey. It says, the, the God of our fathers raised up Jesus, whom he slew and hanged on the tree. Him that God exalted with his right hand to be a prince and savior, for to give repentance to Israel and forgive, forgiveness of sins, a savior to give repentance to Israel. Wow. person needs to get in and read the, read the Bible every day. What is scripture? Scripture is the Bible, are the Bible verses. The Bible verses in, in the, the Bible, Christ came for Israel. 
And DJ John, well, hello, DJ. DJ, yes. I forgot my lipstick tonight, but that's that's fine. I was I was kind of in a hurry to get on here, and I forgot to put my lipstick on, but that's all right. It's all good. Matthew fifteen twenty four. No, you reading. Matthew 15. Matthew. Hang in there, Yvette. Hey, good to see you on. Well, I'm glad to be on. I'm glad to be on. What did you say, Matthew? Did you say Matthew 15? I'm a little I'm a little slow tonight. I'm running just a little bit slow tonight. Chapter 15. I have a I have a brother on here that wants me to read. Okay, I'm in Matthew 15. You're okay, Gloria. Are you sure? It's okay, okay. It's a it's a walk. <laughs> All right, okay. Um, Matthew, I've got Matthew 15. Welcome, moral moral. Is, a, is there first day on Periscope? Well, welcome to Periscope and welcome to my Periscope. I'm Pastor Gloria. No rush. I love the word. Oh, I do too. I love getting in. I, I love getting into the word. All right. Chapter 15. I'm going to read chapter 15. I love Matthew. Matthew, Mark, Luke, John. I love, I love the four Gospels. I'm just going to read chapter 15. It says I have nine. Nine on here. And Yvette, you know what? I'll pray, honey. Anything that you, you want me to pray about, I will. I'll, I'll pray. I'll pray for you. I love you very much. He was talking to a Canaanite woman. Talking to a Canaanite woman. Okay. It says, then, then came to Jesus scribes and Pharisees which were of Jerusalem, saying, Why do thy disciples that transgress the tradition of the, for, of the elders? For they wash not their hands when they eat bread. Non-Israelite. Non but he answered and said unto them, Why do ye also transgress the commandment of God by your tradition? For God commanded, saying, Honor thy father and mother, and he that curseth father or mother, let him die the death. We are to honor our father and mother. But ye say, Whosoever shall say to his father or his mother, It is a gift by whatsoever thou mightest be profited by me. Just a little tired. Okay, I'm not gonna be on I'm not gonna be on here too long, sweetheart. Okay, verse six. And honor not his father or his mother, he shall be free. And honor not his father or his mother, he shall be free. Thus have ye made the commandment of God of none effect by your tradition. Ye hypocrites, well did Isaiah prophesy of you, saying, These people draw up nigh unto me and with their mouth, and honoreth me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. Yes, yes, Isaiah. But in, the vain, but in vain they do worship me, teaching for doctrines the commandments from, of men. And Michael Reger joined. Well, hello. Well, hello, Michael, dear. I'm glad that you joined. Hello. And Jessa. Hello, jo Jessa. God bless you, sweetheart. I'm glad, glad that you guys joined. Yes, I'm just reading out of Matthew chapter 15. Okay, but in vain they do worship me, teaching for, for doctrines the commandments of men. Blessing. Well, blessings to you too. James Joseph, 1981, joined. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. Jorcy, and Jorcy's on. Well, hello, Jorcy. That's my daughter. She's on too. My son-in-law, Michael, they're, they're both on. Well, bless your heart. I'm glad that you guys jumped on. Isaiah 29, 13. Hello, Pastor. Explain Psalms 138. Hold on a minute. I'm, I'm reading. Hang on just a second. Jordan Fisher joined. Well, hello. My grandson's on. Hey, Joycey. Hey, Jordan Fisher. I love you. Love you all. I'm so glad you guys jumped on tonight. I'm so glad you did. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Okay, let's see. Um, just got home from work. Okay. Okay, I bet you're tired. I'm reading out of Matthew chapter 15. Chapter 15. Uh, let's see. 
and T Car 86 joined. Well, hello, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. And thank you for the pretty hearts. Can I send him up there with you? <laughs> hello, Mom, from another generation. From another generation. Oh, my, Jordan. When you read the Bible, it must be read precept upon precept to get the understanding. Isaiah 20, 8, 10. Read Matthew 15, 24. Okay. Okay, but he called the multitude and said unto them, verse 10, Hear and understand, not that which goeth into the mouth, oh, I like this one, not that which goeth into the mouth defileth a man, but that which cometh out of the mouth defileth, this defileth a man. That's what I've always said. It's not what goes in the mouth, but goes in the temple that defiles the temple. It's what, it's what comes out that defiles the temple. Yes, KJV only. KJV only. Yes, yes. Wow. Then came his disciples and said unto him, Knowest thou that the Pharisees were offended that after they heard their, this saying? But he answered and said, Every plant which my heavenly Father hath not planted shall be rooted up. Let them alone. They be blind leaders of the blind. And if the blind lead the blind, both shall fall into the ditch. Both shall fall into the ditch. I love it. Then answered Peter and said unto him, Declare unto us this parable. And Jesus said, Are ye also yet without understanding? Do not ye yet understand that whatsoever entereth in at the mouth goeth into the belly and is cast out into the drought? But those things which proceed out of the mouth come forth from the heart, and they defile the man. For out of the heart proceed evil thoughts, murders, adulteries, fornications, thefts, false witnesses, and blasphemies. Apples joined. Well, hello. Hello. I'm glad you joined. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. Fornications, thefts, false witnesses, blasphemies. These are the things which defile a man. But to eat with unwashed hands defileth not a man. Defileth not a man. All right. Heart is, heart is the mind. I use a Bible called the Scriptures. Really? Really? Okay. Okay. Wow. All right. That's right. Well, hello, everybody. Pastor, can you explain Revelation 114? I don't know. I can try. I can try. Revelation 114. I have, I have some of the best down here to help me. Channel 8. Revelation 114. Revelation 114. That's what I say. That's why it's best to get into the Word. Study the Word. I read. I want to tell uh, Michael, my daughter and son-in-law, something too. Uh, that song by the Beatles years ago, Jude, "Hey Jude, Jude." I felt the Lord wanted me to read the book of Jude. Now I hadn't even thought of that song in years and years and years. But I felt the Lord wanted me to read Jude, so I read Jude. All right, Pastor, you didn't reach verse twenty-four. Hang on. Revelation one. You mean 24 of Matthew? Of, I forgot what you said a while ago. I, I got a little bit distracted. I got a little bit distracted. I know you're able and I know you can. I played uh, Mercy Me at the beginning of the scope. Even if I love that song. And I'm going to make sure that I put in the description box. That's who it is. Lies at 17 join. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. And God bless you. Well, I must have missed something. He said something about 24. I must have missed something. Revelation 114. Yes. Blessings, Pastor. Well, blessings to you too, Lisa. Well, yes. Revelation 114 described, described the Almighty. Revelation 114. All right. Verse 14. I'm going to read. I love to do this. I, I love to do this. I love getting into the Word. I love getting into the Word. Jessa joined again. She joined again. All right. Here we go. I'm going to read Revelation chapter 1. Revelation chapter 1. The revelation of Jesus Christ which God gave unto him to show unto his servant, servants things which must shortly come to pass. 
and he sent and signified it by his angel unto his servant John, who bear record of the word of God and of the testimony of Jesus Christ and of all things that he saw. Blessed is, is he that readeth, and that they hear the words of this prophecy and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. For the time is at hand. John to the seven churches which are in Asia, grace be unto you which peace from which from him which is, and which was, and which is to come, from the seven spirits which are before the throne. All right, and from Jesus Christ, who is the faithful witness, and the first begotten of the dead, and the prince of the kings of the earth, and to him that loved us and washed us from our sins in his own blood. Yukon Lou joined. Well, hello, I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope, and God bless you. And hath made us kings and priests unto God and his Father, to him be glory and dominion over forever and ever. Behold, he cometh with clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierced him, and all kindreds of the earth shall wail because of him. Even so, I am Alpha, the Omega, the beginning and the end, ending, saith the Lord, which is, and which was, and which is to come, the Almighty. Yes, talking about, talking about, when, when he comes, when he comes, I, John, who also am your brother, and companion in tribulation and in the kingdom and patience of Jesus Christ was in the isle that is called Patmos for the word of God and for the testimony of Jesus Christ. I was in the spirit on the Lord's day and heard behind me a great voice as of a trumpet. Shofar, Michael. Wow. Saying, I am Alpha and Omega, the first and the last. And what thou seest, write in a book and send it into the seven churches which are in Asia unto Ephesus and into Smyrna and into Pegamos and into Thyateria and into Sardis and into Philadelphia and into Lacedonia. I just need 14 and 15. Well, I'm going to, I'm going to read, I'm going to read them. I'm going to read them. 14 and 15, please. All right. 14 and 15. It says his head and his hairs were white like wool as white as snow and his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned into a furnace. And his voice is a sound of many waters. His voice is a sound of many waters. Wow. It's something else. It's something else. Wow. Okay. Is there anything, is there anything else that anybody wants me to read tonight? Because I said I wasn't going to be on here too late. I'm just glad. I'm glad that my, my family jumped on. I'm glad that Yvette, Yvette jumped on. I'm glad everybody did. The ones that can't explain, please. Uh, explain. Explain what? So why the white image of Christ then? I love the book of Revelation. I do too. I do too. And anybody can help me if they want they want to help me because like I said I'm running I'm doing going kind of slow tonight it's giving you the color of Christ amen amen like I said I'm 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 running kind of slow tonight I'm, I'm just running really slow yes yes revelations chapter 1 verses 14 15 explain that no problem what color what color is brass? What color is brass? Brass is like a golden, a golden color. Brass is. Come on, Pastor. What's what's wrong? I'm just I'm just running kind of slow, running kind of slow, and I feel that there's something not quite right with a very dear friend of mine. Now burnt brass. There's something just isn't quite right with with a dear friend of mine, and, and I I can sense I can sense it I can sense it. I can sense it. I can sense something's not right. And I know that the Lord wanted me to get on here. I know that he wanted me to read Jude. So I read Jude. What color is brass when you when you burn it? I don't know what color it is when you burn it. I don't know. <laughs> What's going on? I don't know. The Almighty... It's black. Are you going to explain? J um, I 
Yeah. Yeah, I, I feel a demonic. Anything burnt becomes a dark color. Grass is dark. I know what you are saying. I just sense something. Christ, so-called black man. That's what it was. Besides something else too. Did I broad, did I do the wrong one? I hope I didn't. Is that the right? We don't focus on it. Yeah. Isn't that something? How you can feel something evil? We are giving you the understanding of the Bible. Yeah. I rebuke you, Satan, in the name of Jesus. I rebuke you, Satan, in the name of Jesus. You have no authority. You have no authority on this scope. We bind you and we send you back to the pit of hell. We bind you, for it is written, Man shall not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeded out of the, out of the mouth of God. We bind you and we send you back to the pit of hell. You have no authority. You have no authority. Now leave in Jesus' precious holy name. The demons tremble at the name of Jesus. They tremble at the name of Jesus. So get out of here. In Jesus' precious holy name. In his precious, precious holy name we pray. Amen and amen. The blood of Jesus is for all the nations all of the people. Yes. Isn't that something? It was an evil It was an evil presence, but, but there's still something else, though, that it doesn't feel quite right, though. But yes, there was an evil presence. For all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. Yes, yes. That's right. We have to pray. We have to pray. Satan's going to use every device, everything he can. He's going to use everything he can to try to get to us. Get us distracted. Can we go to Romans 9? Can we go to Romans 9, 1 through 3? Romans 9, 1 through 3. But the gift of God is eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Yes, yes, yes. In the name of the in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Oh shoot. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Thumbs up. It's something in it. When we when we have discernment, I I knew there was an evil. I don't know why that I didn't go ahead and just do that. Sometimes demons make you feel yes. I just I was just bogged way just bogged way down just bogged down. Wow, that was something. And usually I usually I pick up on I, I usually pick up on it really right away. Thank you, Jessa too, sweetheart, and thank you, Lisa. Thank you, thank you both. But usually I, I pick up I pick up on that, you know. But like I said, the devil it lifted. Yes it did, Yvette. Yes it did. It did. But I'm usually pretty quick on that too, you know. I mean come on. Come on, he spoke he spoke the truth. I was it was like you were being double teamed. Yeah. Double yeah. It was, it was. It was. I just, I just, well, I don't even want to think about it, you know, and, and we are going to be attacked. Yeah, we are going to be attacked. We have to be, we have, that's why we have to armor up, keep praying a bit more. Yes, that's what I was going to say. That's why we have to armor up, armor up and get into the word. Just bathe ourselves in this, in this word because somebody's going to ask us questions and we're not going to know, no, just a question. We're not going to know what to say. If we if we don't if we don't know how to answer them, we're not gonna we're not gonna know what to say, you know. So that taught me that taught me a more of a lesson. Put on the full armor of God. Yes, the whole armor of God, the breastplate of righteousness and the helmet of salvation, and take up the shield of faith. Gotta love. Yeah, I know it. That's why it pays. The Lord the Lord taught me another lesson too, to get into His Word more. Get into to His Word. 
again, bathe in the word. Bathe in the word that you may stand against the wiles of the devil. Exactly. That's what I always say. So we can come up, up, up against the wiles of the devil. Because he seeks to kill, steal, and destroy. Please pray. Pre, please pray some more. I am. I am going to pray. I'm, I am going to pray. Do you celebrate Easter? No, I do not. Easter is is the Eastern goddess. Easter has nothing to do with Jesus. That term does not have anything to do with. I call it the Passover. Gloria, watch one on here. There is one more. Oh boy. Lord, please give me discernment. Give me discernment. Pray, Glory, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. And we give you all the honor and the glory and the praise in your precious, precious holy name, dear Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. In your precious, precious holy name. You know, the demons tremble the name of Jesus. Jesus is the word made flesh. Bathing in the word is bathing in his righteousness. Yes. Yes. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. There is something about his name. There's something about his name. Jesus. 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 Something about his name. Like the fragrance. After the rain. Put ye on the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. Yes, pagan Easter is pagan. Yes, Michael, you got that right on the right on the yes. Easter is pagan. I'm celebrating the Feast of Tabernacle this week. Love that love that song. Oh Jesus, yeah, I do too. Kings and kingdoms shall all pass away but there's something about that name yes there's something about that name jesus the name of all names the lord of all lords and the king of all kings our lord and our savior jesus christ yes the one that went to the cross. He is Sabbath keeper. Jesus, this is the stone which was set at naught of your build, which has become the head of the corner. Praise God, hallelujah. Praise God, hallelujah. You know, like I said before, the, de the demons are going to come at us now more than ever. And we have to be re we have to be prepared. I could take a drink of water real quick. I'm about to gag here. <laughs> we have to be prepared. Parker, eleven thirteen, eleven seven thirteen, John. Well, hello, good good evening. Welcome to my scope, and God bless you. Welcome to my scope, everybody. You are you. I have sat. I I have, I I recognize the Sabbath day every day. Good evening. The true Sabbath day is Friday sundown till Saturday sundown. That is the true Sabbath. Gloria, a blocked and Gloria blocked another person. Their profile picture was demonic. Feel even. Wow. I think I know. I think I know. I hope I'm right. I hope we're right. Praise God, hallelujah. Praise God, hallelujah. Jesse, yes. <laughs> Demons come through many means. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Most assuredly. Yes, they come through many, 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 many ways, many means. And the devil's time is short, and he knows it. The devil's time is short, and he knows it. Amen, Lisa? The devil's time is short. And he's going to try to get as many people away from Jesus as he can. He's going to try to win as many souls away from Jesus as he can. Yes, yes. Amen. Praise God. Amen. 
We give all we give God all the honor and the glory and the praise in his precious one name. They even try to use words of God to be careful. Yeah, I know it. They're running wild and wide open. Yes, they are, Michael. Yes, they are. They sure are. Yes, they sure are. How, so how are you feeling tonight? How are you doing tonight, Michael, dear? How are you doing tonight? Yeah, we've got our jobs cut out for us. And that's why we have to to oil. We have to put. We have to know ourselves. Pastor, you keep. Do, do you keep God's feast days? I'm not. I'm not Jewish. I'm not Jewish, but I do. I do believe in in, in some of the. You're okay, Michael. Okay. Yeah, they get it twisted for sure. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. Yeah, they do. spaghetti so I could swallow it with no problem. That's good, Michael. That's good. I'm glad. These feast days are not Jewish. I feel the scope. I feel the scope feels clearer now. Maybe a small bit of residue. Yeah, so do I. I don't want to do the wrong thing, if you know what I mean. I don't want to do the wrong thing. just have to just pray pay attention oh yes I am Jesse pray that residue lifts yes in Jesus precious holy name the residue lifts in Jesus precious precious holy name well hello truth for you well hello I'm Pastor Gory up to my scope just don't do anything okay praise God hallelujah Everyone is welcome. Everyone is welcome as long as they show show just as long as they show me respect. Everybody is welcome. Yes. And everybody on here, we're all we're all children of of God. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Yes. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Divine Holy Spirit and protection over this scope in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes. Yes. Divine Holy Protection. Holy Protection, dear Jesus. A hedge of protection. That's right. Show respect. Yes. 4782183 joined. Well, hello. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. God bless you. God bless you. Amen. Yes. 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 Well. I love you all. I love you all. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. The more we pray, the more we bring just to work in our benefits. Yes, releases. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. Praise God. Hallelujah. <coughs> Hebrews. Hebrews. Chapter 1. God, who at sundry times and in in diverse manners spake in time past unto the fathers of the prophets by the prophets hath in these last days spoken unto us by his son whom he hath appointed heir of all things by whom also he made the worlds angels hearken to the word of god yes who being the brightness of his glory and the ex and the express image of his person and upholding all things by the word of his power when he had by himself purged our sins sat down on the right hand of the majesty on high being made so much better than the angels, as he hath by inheritance obtained a more excellent name than they. For unto which of the angels said at, in, at he at any time, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. 
thee, and again I will be to him a father, and he shall be to me a son. And again, when he bringeth to his first begotten into the world, he saith, And let all the angels of God worship him. And of the angels he saith, Who maketh his angels spirits, and his ministers a flame of fire? But unto the Son he saith, Thy throne, O God, is forever and ever. A scepter of righteousness is the scepter of thy kingdom. Wow. Thou hast loved righteousness and hated iniquity. Therefore God, even thy God, hath anointed thee with the oil of gladness above thy fellows. Vitamin, standard, mineral, and vitamin three. Well, thank you. And, and God bless you. Welcome to my scope. A reading out of Hebrews chapter one. And then... Thou, Lord, in the beginning hast laid the foundation of the earth, and the heavens are the works of thine hands. They shall perish, but thou remainest, and they all shall wax old as doth a, doth a garment. Okay. Verse 13. But to which the angels... Yeah. But to which, the, of, the, which of the angels said be, he at any time, Sit on my right hand, until I make thine enemies thy footstool, are they all not all ministering spirits sent forth to minister for them who shall be heirs of salvation? I'm going to read verse 14 again. Yes, Hebrews 1. I'm going to read 14 again. Hello, everybody. This is coming in. God bless you. I'm Pastor Gloria. Chapter 14, I mean, verse 14 of chapter 1 of Hebrews. Are they not all ministering spirits sent forth to minister for them who shall be heirs of salvation? Just a minute here. Hebrews 1, 4, 1.14. Okay. Hebrews 1.14. Michael joined again. Hebrews 1.14. And, and for, for as much then as the children are partakers of flesh and blood, he also himself likewise took part of the same, that through death he might destroy him that had the power of death. That is the devil. That is the devil, yes. And deliver them who through fear of death were all their lifetime subject to bondage. For verily he took not on him the nature of angels, but he took on him the seed of Abraham. Yes. Yes. Chapter 3, I'm going to read just a little bit of this, all right? Wherefore, holy brethren, partaking of the heavenly calling, consider the apostle and the high priest of our profession, Jesus Christ, who was faithful to him that appointed him, as also Moses was faithful in all his house for this man was counted worthy of mine glory than Moses inasmuch as he hath built the house hath more honor than the house for every house is built by some man but he that built all things is God and Moses verily was faithful in all his house as a servant for a testimony of those which were to be spoken after which was to be spoken after but as Christ is a son over his own house whose house are we Whose house are we? If we fa if we hold fast the confidence and the rejoicing of the hope firm unto the end, where wherefore as the Holy Ghost saith, today if you will hear His voice, today if you will hear His voice. Well, hello, uh, Pastor D. Boris joined. Well, good evening. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. I'm reading out of Hebrews, Hebrews chapter three. Okay, wherefore, as the Holy Ghost saith today, if ye will hear his voice, harden not your hearts, as in the provocation in the day of temptation in the wilderness, when your fathers tempted me, proved me, and saw my works forty years. Wherefore, I was grieved with the generation, and said, They do always err in their heart, and they have not known my ways. So I swear in my wrath, they shall not enter into my rest. Take heed, brethren, lest there be any of you an evil heart of unbelief in departing from the living God. But exhort one another daily, which is called today, lest any of you be hardened through the deceitfulness of sin. For we are made protectors of Christ if we hold the beginning of our confidence steadfast unto the end. While it is said today, if ye will hear his voice, harden not your heart, your hearts, as in the provocation. For some, when they had heard, did provoke albeit not all that came out of Egypt by Moses. Wow. Wow. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I think that feeling is pretty much lost. 
God. Pastor Leviticus 23, to read that, tells who the feast belongs to, not Jewish, Jewish feast. Question is destroying your brick is destroying your beard a sin? I was reading Leviticus 19:27. Is destroying your beard a sin? You mean you mean shaving it off? Is this, is it a sin? I don't think so. Correct. Okay. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. Praise the Lord, hallelujah. <laughs> chapter 4 of 1 John. Chapter 4 of 1 John. Be sure the spirits are of God. I'm looking for the understanding. It said don't mar, don't mar your, your beard. It says, Beloved, believe not every spirit, but try the spirits whether they are of God, because many false prophets are gone out into the world. Hereby ye know ye the Spirit of God. Every spirit that confesseth that Jesus Christ has come in the flesh is of God. And every spirit that confesseth not that Jesus Christ has come in the flesh is not of God. And this is that spirit of Antichrist. That whereof ye have heard that it should come, and even now already is in the world. <clears throat> ye are of God, little children, and have overcome them, because greater is he that is in you than he that is in this world. Wow. They are of the world, therefore speak they of the world, and the world heareth them. We are of God. He that knoweth God heareth us. He that is not of God heareth not us. Hereby know we the spirit of truth and the spirit of, spirit of error, E-R-R-O-R. Beloved, let us love one another, for let, for love is of God, and every one that loveth is born of God, and knoweth God. He that loveth not knoweth not God, for God is love. For God is love. Wow. He wanted me to. He want me to read that. Verse eleven it says, "Beloved, if God so loved us, we ought to ought also to love one another. No man man has at, has seen God at any time. If we love one another, God dwelleth in us, and His love is perfected in us." Wow. Hereby know that we we that hereby know we that we dwell in him and he in us because he hath given us his, of his spirit. And we have seen and we have seen and do testify that the Father sent the Son to be the Savior of the world. Whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwelleth in him and he in God. I love I read I love reading. I love reading. George or um Yvette, I know you're tired, sweetheart. Uh, I love these verses. There's no, verse 18. There is no fear in love, but perfect love casteth out fear, because fear hath torment. He that feareth is not made perfect in love. We love him because he first loved us. We love him because he first loved us. If a man say, I love God, and hateth his brother, he's a liar. For he that loveth not his brother whom he hath seen, how can he love God whom he hath not seen? Establish the law. And this commandment have we from him that he that he who loveth God loveth his brother also. Loveth his brother also. And I'm going to do the Lord's Prayer and I'm going to let everybody go for the night. It's 11 o'clock. I'm, I'm going to do the Lord's Prayer and I'm going to let everybody go, okay? Go back and watch the replay. Maybe some people might learn some things when they watch the replay, hopefully. In the, name of, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, I was mainly because of the demons trying to make us tired and slow. Yes, I know, I know, I know, I know. We have to stay prayed up, Yvette, dear. We have to stay prayed up. I love you very much. And all that joined tonight, all that joined, on Remy 7 joined. Well, good evening. I'm getting ready to... to uh, Say the Lord's Prayer. I'm Pastor Gloria. I'm going to do the Lord's Prayer, and then I'm going to go for the night distraction. Jess, Jessa. Shalom, Pastor. Shalom to you, too. Shalom to you, too. Let's do the Lord's Prayer.
our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory forever. Amen and amen. And they all said, hey, amen. Well, hello, hello. Um, go back and watch my replay. I'm Pastor Gloria. Welcome to my scope. I've been on. Love y'all. Yes, I've been on. I've been on for a while now. And so, again, God bless you all. And remember, eyes to the sky, for we know not when our Lord will return. We know not the day or the hour. We must be ready. Put on the whole armor of God, the breastplate of righteousness, and the helmet of salvation, and take up the field, the shield of faith. To be able to come up against the wiles of, of the, the devil. Do you have Instagram? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So on that note, go back and watch the replay until my next my next scope. And also my YouTube channel is Gloria Drummond. Jesus is the answer. That's my YouTube channel. So feel free to, to, to jump on over there and check that out. So I love you all. So Pastor Gloria is, is saying good night for the night. Okay? Stay in prayer. Stay armored up. Give me, please. Give me, please, I, I added you. Uh, sweet Jesus, peace. Yes, su sweet Jesus, peace for night's sleep. Um, I, I'm i not sure what I am on Instagram. Uh, I forgot what I am on Instagram. I can't think, I can't, oh, excuse me, I can't think straight right now. But um, I am on, um, you can find me on Facebook. Um, just look, just look under Gloria Drummond. And like I said, my YouTube channel also. God bless you all. I love you. So until my next scope. Okay, good night. Good night.